this is video from approximately um, Pit Lochery. Um, you can see the roads were really quite good. The conditions were good, the visibility was good. It was very, very quiet in some places and I uh, really enjoyed the drive. Uh, part of the drive I was chatting to other courier drivers, which helps pass the time on a long drive. And you can see here, just these 10 second clips, there's been almost nobody on the road coming in the other direction. So I set off from Glasgow Airport at around uh, half past one and got up to Inverness Airport at approximately five o'clock and found where I had to tip. But yeah, the roads were super quiet. Like I said, I was chatting to a couple of other drivers on the way up the road, um, which was lovely and lovely wife also. And it's a great drive. So we're getting up to, this is coming up to Dromochter Pass now. Um, which is the, one of the highest points of the road and probably parts of the road that I really enjoy the most. And you can see, although the camera doesn't really capture it, you know, the scenery is, although it was a bit of a dull day, it's still absolutely, absolutely fantastic. And part of the way up the road, there was a farmer having a, well, what looked like a supposed to be a controlled hill fire burn to get rid of... Um, heather I guess on the ground to clear it for something else but you can't really see that on the camera and then coming up sort of shortly we start to get to the point where we've already passed um, Aviemore and Kingusi and then we start you know the long run downhill and basically the, with the exception of one small uphill section we run downhill for about 30 minutes in towards Inverness. So it's starting to get dark now, um, although the camera really seems to capture the light a lot better than I had expected. But again, you can see, so this is us at around about 4, 4.30. And we had a little flurry of traffic coming towards us, I'm guessing from Inverness. And uh, unfortunately, I missed it on the camera, but at the Dromochter Pass, there was a train going by. And the nice thing about Dromochter is the road is right beside the railway track. So if you stop at the lay-by that's there you can actually stand at a gate which is sort of two meters from the actual railway track and when you have one of the, the big fast trains go thundering by yeah it's quite exhilarating watch out for part two when we get right down to Inverness and then across to Inverness airport <laughs> 